I'm here as close to the Federal Reserve as I'm going to get right now. We've got a few people over there. Before 1913, central banks occasionally existed for right now, by way of renewable charges. Listen to uh, a, a local candidate running for office. The same Let's give a second. We're experiencing today, and perhaps the most famous charter revocation was spearheaded by President Andrew Jackson. He said, and I quote, "Gentlemen, I have had men watching you for a long time, and I am convinced that you have used the funds of the bank to speculate in the breadstuffs of the country." When you won, you divided the profits among you, and when you lost, you charged it back to the banks. He goes on to say, you tell me that if I take the deposits from the bank and annul its charter, I shall ruin 10,000 families. That may be true, gentlemen, but that is your sin. Should I let you go on, you will ruin 50,000 families, and that would be my sin. You are a den of vipers and thieves. I intend to rob you out, and by the grace of the eternal God, I will rob you out. Yeah! It is past the time to annul the Federal Reserve's charter. The inflation tax has no semblance of lawfulness, as it is not under any direct control or scrutiny of our uh, elected representatives. The immorality this is one of, my of taxation big fans. without <laughs> representation was the primary catalyst that sparked the war for our nation's independence more than 233 years ago. Oh, taxation without representation <laughs> is oh, no less immoral channel. today right. than it was then. This is my YouTube channel. I'm talking taxing, man. Say, say hi and say I'm the fad. I'm the fad, yes. Teabaggers, right-wing nuts up, and even domestic Come on, what's going on my YouTube channel, man? Say hi. And the Fed? And the Fed. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Anybody else? Yeah. I'm Psychic Taxi. This is my YouTube channel. I've been posting blogs on uh, YouTube all week long. Cool. Yeah. This, these are the people that set this up. Introduce yourself, please. Uh, Brooke from Peoria. Jason Moore, Beacon. Right on. You know, stuff like this doesn't happen unless people like you do it. Yes. Thank you so very much for wanting to take your country back and actively doing something about it. No need for thanks. I'm young, it's my future. Yeah, I hear it. I'm here because I have a cousin and grandchildren, and I don't want their children who haven't been born yet mm -hmm. to be born as slaves. Mm -hmm. That's right, that's right. Thank you so very much. Thank you. Anybody else want to say hi to my YouTube channel? Huh? In the Fed? Want to say in the Fed? Huh? Ooh. It's illegal. <laughs> yes. It goes it goes against this right here. This is this is the this is the supreme law of the land, the constitution. Okay? It says you cannot give away your powers to a private corporation that's gonna charge us with interest for something we used to create for free. <laughs> that's stealing. You wanna say something to your friends, the youth of America? Why are you here, man? Why are you here? Why are you here? Oh, well, thank you so very much for coming because that's where it begins. The information goes in, it has to get processed before anything can come out. This gentleman here, he's listening, he's processing. Maybe next year he'll be one up there speaking because if you run for office, you can tell the people the truth and they'll hear the truth and say, look, there's an honest man, they'll vote for you. And then you have the power to do what's right. Huh? Keep listening. Oh, this guy. This is AJ, man. Hey, what's going on? AJ, AJ's one badass dude, okay? Love and freedom, that's he, right. He's one of those guys that helped put this thing on. You know, this stuff doesn't happen unless people like this that's right. step up. That's right. So, if I can do it, if he can do it, you can do it. It's all for freedom. <laughs> Absolutely, my friend. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. We still have years yet. This is my buddy Steve. What up, man? The Love Liberty. Delegate from the great state of Ohio. That's right, the Buckeyes. Woo-hoo-hoo! What up? Woo. Spread the message. Oh, and the man. Fed. Educate your community. Get on the boards. Go to your... Uh, your school board meetings, go to your count, city council meetings, become a precinct committeeman, take it back over. 
Don't expect somebody to do it for you. That's not how this works. It takes all of us to educate ourselves and those around us. That's what it takes. Oh, there's Micah. Hold on. There's Micah. I got to get him in there. This guy, this guy is on my on my technology website team. He's a volunteer non-delegate on our team, and I'll tell you what, he's a valuable member of our team. You know, this is the youth. This is the youth. The, this guy taught me stuff about computers. All right, I'm, I'm a computer user from way back, but I got out of touch because I'm doing this stuff, and I need a little help from this from from my laptop here. And he said, "Well, just go here, download this, and we'll run this." And, he wiped out my registry. I had to go back through him, put all my passwords in for every lousy place I ever had. But he taught me how to clean some of my computer out, and it works a little better. So I'm glad. What do you think about this end of Fed thing, man? Oh, jeez, we need more of these things. This is this is great. This is just amazing. And some of the speakers have just been absolutely phenomenal out here. I mean, uh -oh. I can't believe this this video that they're shooting here. We can't actually go over to the Federal Reserve and actually say what we want to the people who need it. We're making a but movie about robbing banks. Oh, come on. The God, banks are the robbers. It, it's ironic. You know. Get out here. You know that they knew we were coming, okay? That's not some sort of, uh, of accident. They put a permit at the front of the Federal Reserve saying that they were going to make a movie. So of that course. now we can't get over there. Oh, no. I mean, but, but, but can we? You know, there's people over there at the building with flags and stuff. And oh, look. There's Catherine's over there. Yeah, they're over there in front of the sign. They say they walk past the cops and say, "Hey, you know what? First Amendment rights, and we want, we're going by." So. No, nobody's gonna mess with any of us. Okay. No liar. Ooh, another guy from our, wec our, our, our website tech team. Hi, everyone. What would you like to say to the world, sir? I'd like to say that pretty soon we're going to have the Articles of Freedom online for everyone to read. I'm not 100% sure of the domain name, but go to cc2009.us and we'll post updates there. And you can go and you can read the body of work that all the delegates have created for the last 11 days. And let me tell you, these guys are up till 3 a.m., awake at 8 a.m. for 11 days to do this for you. So please, please go to cc2009.us and wait for the update, and we'll tell you where to go so you can read these documents. Yeah, thank you so much. Coming over here again. You want to say happy birthday to the Federal Reserve? Oh, I'm so happy <laughs> that this is the last birthday the Federal Reserve is ever going to have again. I sure hope so. Oh, no, it is. This lady here, I've walked with her down the down the street, and she she had some activist stuff to say. Wow. Um, happy birthday, Federal Reserve. I know you're enjoying our gifts. Um, I hope this is your last birthday because I know I it can be really hard to suffer through a long life. 